everybody. Increasing the commercial tax base and creating more job opportunities. These kind of things are fun to me because I enjoy serving others. But I'm reminded of Ecclesiastes that says to everything there's a time, that there's a season, and a time to every purpose. For me, that season is over, and the purpose has changed. Tonight, I'm announcing my resignation from the board. No. Affected down this block. As many of you know, as many of you know, I missed the last BFC meeting. I've missed several other associated events, as well as a couple of other BFC meetings. The demands on my schedule have become increasingly more difficult to manage. I give this a tremendous amount of thought. I've been planning it for quite some time. I wanted to get through our budget planning, we, our budget retreats. I wanted to get through the issue with losing our county manager. I wanted to get through the issue of hiring a manager. I'm happy to be able to be a part of all of that. <coughs> To this wonderful staff, I want to tell you I appreciate your professionalism and your dedication to all of you serve. You've made my job an absolute pleasure. And much easier than I expected for someone like myself outside of county or any government experience. I've learned a lot, and I appreciate the opportunity to serve. I've done my best, and I'll resign with no regrets. As for the future, the Lord has blessed me with a wonderful staff at work. They have kept the business going in my absence. It is now time for me to get more engaged and focused my energy on it and move it forward. <coughs> I've gotten involved in research and development in the ag industry and some other industries and I plan to continue that more aggressively, particularly because of the importance of agriculture to feeding the world. That's where my heart is. I enjoy serving others and I will continue to do so in some capacity but my calling is somewhere else now. I'm confident someone will step forward to complete my term who will be committed to working on behalf of the citizens. In the meantime, the current board majority, for the most part, is like mine. So the decisions will come to practically the same conclusion, it's a conclusion you know, without my vote. <laughs> To all those who have trusted me with the responsibility, I want to thank you. Thank you. It's been an honor. One last thing. I would ask that this board would please continue to put an effort to get the land issue at the hospital entrance squared away so we can sign. <laughs> I've worked on that for nine years. I never thought it would be that difficult to get this thing resolved. So, uh, Please keep that in mind as we move forward. I, uh, I appreciate the opportunity to do that, and I, I just kind of want to get it handled before the meeting and uh, before we start our meeting. And I wanted to do it while most people here should be first hand information. And I just say thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome.